A Houston man is in the hospital with burns over much of his body after his garage exploded. The family blames Centerpoint Energy and a gas leak for the near fatal blast. As local news Gianna Caserta tells us, the family says they could smell something was wrong, but they say their calls for help fell on deaf ears. Eduardo Maltos was critically injured after an explosion in his garage. Now his family is suing Centerpoint Energy, saying a gas leak was the cause of the explosion. It smelled so bad, our heads would hurt, our neighbors' heads hurt, and, you know, I mean, it became unbearable. Maltos's lawyers say people in the neighborhood have been complaining about the gas leak for years, but it was never properly fixed. Everybody's been calling, everybody, you know, has been, they've been down here testing it, you know, keeping an eye on it and all that, but uh, apparently it didn't work. The incident occurred in this home behind me. Firefighters say when he opened the garage door, a vapor buildup exploded. He lit a candle and upon lighting the lighter, it ignited with a big blue flame and it blew the door off his garage. Tuesday morning, a judge granted a temporary restraining order to preserve evidence. Maltus's lawyers went back to the neighborhood to hand the order to Centerpoint employees. It seems like it took one man getting horrifically burned over 40% of his body. You know, Ed is only 31 years old and he is burned beyond recognition. Maltus sustained second and third degree burns on his upper torso and face. He is going to get some surgery um, probably today or tomorrow. He's going to get some skin grafts in his arm and his um, stomach. He remains in critical condition. Reporting in Northeast Houston, Gianna Caserta, KPRC Local 2. CENTERPOINT'S PUBLIC RELATIONS MANAGER WOULD NOT COMMENT ON THE PENDING LITIGATION. THEY ARE CONDUCTING AN INVESTIGATION TO DETERMINE THE CAUSE OF THE INCIDENT.